Meet Pedro. Pedro is a talented cook with ambitious dreams. He has opened his own small food joint with his money that he has saved in his personal account. His customers love his recipes, and his business is doing quite well. This motivates him to expand his business further into a larger restaurant. Unfortunately, Pedro doesn't have enough funds to do so. Hola, Alejandra. Hola, hey brother, why so sad? I don't have enough money for the expansion of my restaurant. Uh oh, I'm sure you can find a way to get that money. From where? Why don't you take a loan from the bank? Pedro happily goes to the bank to get the loan he needs. Hello, I would like to take a loan to expand my food joint into a restaurant. Do you have any collateral we can keep until you pay off your debt? No, I don't have anything to give. Then we will have to take your restaurant as a collateral. No, I don't want to risk giving away my restaurant. In that case, we cannot help you. <laughs> the senior debt did not take place, and Pedro did not get the loan he needs. Poor Pedro. Hey, Pedro! Uncle O says you are visiting. Hey, Pedro! I heard about your restaurant. Congratulations. Thank you, Uncle. How did the loan process go? It actually didn't work out. Remember, Uncle Osi is a successful businessman. Maybe he can give you some financial advice. Yes, I can actually lend you money, but as a mezzanine debt, I will charge you fifteen percent interest rate on the money you pay me back. But that is higher than the senior debt of the bank. How come? It's because it's riskier for me. I don't have collateral as a guarantee. How so? Paying off a mezzanine debt has a lower priority than that of the senior debt. Oh, can you decrease the interest rate a little? We can further negotiate the value. One of the advantage of the mezzanine debt is its flexible arrangement. I love such advantages. Certainly, also the mezzanine debt will be treated as equity in your company and will therefore increase the value of your stocks. That sounds great. Don't get too excited, though. In the case your business defaults, I will take a portion of your restaurant asset to sell and pay off your debt. That's all right. I'm confident about my recipes. I know the restaurant will do well. One more thing, Pedro. I will also have to add some conditions called covenants in the contract to protect my investment. You will not be allowed to borrow more funds from other sources, and you will have to decrease your spendings. Oh sh! Why? And how would I do that? You can give your employees less benefits, for example. Oh no, I value my employees too much. Well then, we can sort it out later, as long as your spending does not cross the specified spending margin in the contract. Pedro, isn't it wonderful that your lender will be a long-term investor who actually cares about the performance of your business? Yeah, it's awesome. Thank you, Uncle Jose. As you can see, Pedro was able to obtain a loan without using collateral with the help of mezzanine financing. But given the higher risk for the mezzanine loaner, he charged a higher interest rate and added more covenants into the contract. However, both parties benefited from this financing plan. Thank you for listening to our presentation. Cheerio. Yeah.